Good morning, welcome to this week's market update. Nothing major has changed. The world is still going through a synchronized slowdown. The Fed Reserve has still not announced QE3 and Spain has now taken center stage in the Euro debt saga. Well, I think you have heard enough and I'm not going to go through all of them again. Therefore, I'm going to keep it short and simple. Stay defensive. Before that, let's take a look at how the STI has performed. We are saying that the STI is fairly valued at the current level and see later catalysts to drive upside growth, both from a macro perspective whereby we are going to see low growth economically as well as from a technical perspective at which the STI is now testing the major resistance at 3000 level. At this level, it corresponds to the mean forward PE. We had several times previously urged investors to buy when the forward P was at minus one standard deviation. Now at this mean level, we see more downside bias than the upside. I would rather underweight equities at this point. Among equities, we maintain our preference on defensive and high yielding stocks. As investors globally continue their search for yield, we are overweight on the aviation services sector such as SIA Engineering and ST Engineering. We are also overweight on the REITs. Again, we would like to add that the game changer is if central governments in US, Europe or China decide to carry out strong, the word is strong, measures to stimulate the economies. If we do not have that, then the equities market will remain in a Malaya state. That's all for this week. Thank you for watching.